but you're going to want those extra layers getting out the door. It is in the 20s right now for most of the upstate mountain towns. And uh, northeast Georgia, you're in the 30s right now, but below freezing in spots like Hartwell and Elberton. So just be prepared for that if you're getting out the door. Compared to yesterday, this is something that has changed quite a bit. Calmer wind. We have had gusty conditions in the last few days. Now it's calm to a very light breeze in downtown Greenville. Elsewhere, really no wind at all. That's going to keep you feeling good by the afternoon, even though this is still cooler than it should be. Today is about 10 degrees warmer than yesterday. 54 in the afternoon after a cold morning. You have a couple passing clouds. Mountain towns, small chance for an evening rain shower, but otherwise just a sunny start. A couple clouds later today and a high of 51 degrees. So this is a huge improvement. I know it's still chilly, but it's just a better setup than what we have been dealing with. So as long as you keep a nice warm jacket with you, we're going to rate the day a nine out of 10 for this Thursday. So looking good if you have any outdoor plans. Satellite and radar right now shows mainly a clear sky. So as the sun comes up around 715 or so, you'll see a beautiful setup to start the day. Clouds are developing in places like Chattanooga and Knoxville. Uh, rain showers have moved into parts of Huntsville and Nashville. So just be prepared that we do have some rain coming. Mountain towns may see it this evening, but it's not until tomorrow that most of us start to see more of this activity. We will stay in this warmer sector of area. You can see parts of Kentucky and uh, parts of Il um, Indiana seeing a little bit of wintry mix. We will stay out of that colder temperature range for the next few days. So future cast shows nicely this morning starting sunny, the afternoon becoming cloudy and a small rain chance building in this evening in the mountains. Tomorrow we're more overcast with on and off showers, fairly light rain, which is good news for everyone. But Friday you will want to have an umbrella with you. Friday afternoon it actually backs off a little bit. The morning looks a little bit soggier and then it's really Saturday. The rain takes over even more becoming heavier in the afternoon and early evening. Not a great setup for the holiday parades going on on Saturday, but it should clear out in time for some of those events on Sunday. 54 with sun and clouds today, 56 with a few showers tomorrow, warming up to almost 60 degrees on Saturday with that widespread rain. Sunday is the pick of the weekend. Do you want to get outdoors? Upper 60s to low 70s. The mild air finally returns. There's a small chance for a lingering shower still, but for the most part, should be mostly dry Sunday and then Monday another blast of rain comes through before cooling temperatures down again for much of next week. Now we want to get to your riding forecast sponsored by Harley Davidson of Greenville. You want to ride this weekend. Sunday is the best day to do it. However, Saturday you might be able to squeeze in a ride early before the rain begins. It'll be a dry morning 59 with rain in the afternoon though Sunday 72. No real heavy rainfall, just a spotty shower here or there. Mountain Town's looking good too for a Sunday ride. 68 degrees, nice and warm out there. Saturday though, rain does become likely, especially in the afternoon. Chris watching the roads this morning. Hopefully no big backups out the door.